Hey everyone, this is Brendan from Brendan's Travels. Today my new solar panel kit arrived, and I'm going to talk a little bit about it before it gets mounted to the roof of my RV tomorrow afternoon. So this is the first box. Um, this is the small box for just one panel. Um, the one panel comes wrapped in cardboard, like so. And then you open it, and it's a monocrystalline panel. And then the two panels are in this double width box here. Um, my RV already came uh, with two 12 volt batteries and an inverter. Um, eventually I'll be upgrading those, but they're fine for the time being. Um, I decided on these uh, monocrystalline panels uh, for their high efficiency. Um, I liked Renergy because of their positive customer feedback ratings online. Um, the panels are over 20% efficient, uh, which is great. Um, those are near the upper end of the efficiency ratings uh, that are available to end consumers. Um, Renergy also offers a 25-year transferable warranty. Um, which means these uh, panels are guaranteed to maintain at least 80% of their efficiency up to 25 years down the road. Um, monocrystalline technology is a little more expensive, uh, but it's definitely a superior technology when compared with uh, polycrystalline and thin film technology. Um, basically what it means is these individual cells here are comprised of um, just one crystalline structure. Um, it's solid, continuous, and unbroken um, all the way to the edges of the panels here. Um, unlike polycrystalline cells, um, which are broken crystal panels, crystal cells. Uh, so ultimately, this just means that more power is being delivered to the RV house batteries. Um, so let's look at all this stuff down here. Um, this is my LCD charge controller. Um, I decided to go everything uh, by the same manufacturer, uh, Renergy. Um, these are the set of Z brackets. Um, this is 40 feet of uh, solar adapter cable. Uh, this connects the actual panels to the charge controller. And then these are the branch connectors. Uh, positive and negative and these actually connect to the back of the solar cells here uh, this is where the branch connectors go and that will bring power uh, to the LCD charge controller and then ultimately to the 12 volt batteries in the house coach uh, so here's a close-up of one of the panels And then the other two panels are in the double width box. And I'm going to install these tomorrow and I will make a video uh, in a week or so and let you all know how it goes. I uh, hope you all subscribe and enjoy my feed and my future videos. I'll be talking about uh, boondocking and staying in uh, BLM parks and federal campgrounds. And uh, I will talk to you all later. Bye.